I think right now in the women's section, there's like two people. Like there's, there's nobody. Alexis Sunshine 83, it's always sunny here. Hey Sunshiners, Alexa Sunshine 83 here. Today we are doing my annual come thrift with me on Black Friday. I have gone thrifting on Black Friday every year since 2018 minus 2020 and it's interesting to see how thrift stores handle like a sale on Black Friday. Sometimes it has been amazing and other times it's been like, oh, you know, it's something and today I am going to be going to Savers which is doing a sale based on how much you spend so I think it's like the lowest is 20% and then if you spend $75 you get 30% which I don't usually honestly spend $75 at the thrift store so I may get the lowest discount or I may not even get any discount because I, I think with that one you have to still spend a certain amount but I mainly am just going thrifting on Black Friday because it's fun it's a fun title also for a video I'm mainly looking for home decor and sweaters so we will see what the thrift store ends up giving us today it could be amazing but it also could be okay honestly even if I just really find one thing I'm going to be happy I'm more just like in the mood to hunt I'm in the mood to go through the racks I'm in the mood to hear that screeching sound that the hangers make as they glide on onto the rack the thrift store is going to be opening in 15 minutes and I think there are a couple of people in line so let's head over the cardigans and I'm not seeing like basically what I want is kind of like a grandma chunky I don't know kind of like these and I'm finding a lot of thinner or like thicker cardigans that are longer like they aren't button-ups they're like just I guess a cardigan without buttons which isn't really what I'm looking for oh this is kind of like a poncho it's from simply Vera Vera Wang now this is fun I already own something pretty similar and it's in a 3x but very cute I love the colors hmm, I kind of want to try this one on it's 35% wool cotton and acrylic blend and I actually, it's surprisingly soft. The boot section is here, so I'm just seeing what they have. I actually feel like these tapestry ones are pretty fun. Also, these cowboy boots. Oh my gosh. Also, very fun. What size are these? Oh, these are Ariat six and a half. I am looking just for like plain cowboy boots. These are definitely not my size. They're in a size five, but that would be obviously the dream is to find some black cowboy boots at the thrift store. Oh, I wish these were in my size. They are, I don't know what size they are, but they have little bows on the back of them, these black boots. Yeah, I'm not seeing, I mean, there's some cute boots, just none in my size. So we will continue surprisingly there was a good amount of people in line before the store opened but not a while honestly i usually see more people on like a wednesday morning than today um but it actually is then making this process really calm this is probably like the most calm a black friday thrift with me has ever been i'm almost like i'm overwhelmed by how calm and how there's like actually like nobody in the racks like I think right now in the women's section, there's like two people. Like there's, there's nobody. Something else I am looking for is just a black long sleeve. I have a couple of black long sleeves, but one of them has a pattern on it. The other one is cropped and has buttons on it. And I just want plain black long sleeve. 
I think I am actually gonna pause on the black long sleeve because I wanna go to skirts. I am wearing my unitard, so it'll be easy to take off my clothes um, to try stuff on. And so I wanna head there, which as we are heading there, I am gonna go to the actual shoes. You know, you just never know if you're gonna get lucky. In most cases, I don't get lucky with shoes at the thrift store, but you still never know and there's still no 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 what am i looking for in skirts i think definitely maxi potentially floral which i know that's so random because now it's like the time of plaid and i'm wearing a plaid skirt love plaid but i think i want to find floral maxi skirts that's like a dark color so usually with floral skirts they kind of read a little too spring and summer and so I want to find one in a darker color that could go more with fall and just like darker tones. Oh my gosh, these green, okay, they're jeans in the skirt section, but they're from Ralph Lauren. They are in a size 13, 14. <gasps> they are just such a gorgeous, gorgeous deep green color. This was almost what I was talking about. Like the tones are there, but this is originally from Zara and it's in like a, polyester and not a good nice feeling one so basically this but like vintage oh my gosh okay this is so fun i'm pretty sure it's not real leather the tag has been wiped off but based on the orange kind of peeling on the collar but such a fun like leather possibly faux leather blazer since i'm already in the blazers might as well just take a look i think this thrift with me is going to be really chaotic because it's like so much is going on and i'm like going to different things so i apologize that it's not gonna be structured but we're just having we're just having a good time oh this jacket's very fun i like the brown i also haven't been to this thrift store in a couple of months so they actually rearranged it and so i'm like trying to figure out where things are as well the dresses don't have anyone and so i think i'm just gonna go through here real quick i think today is gonna be one of those days where in like 20 minutes all of a sudden a bunch of people are gonna come so i'm trying to like hit up the places that get the busiest sometimes they have like such winter dresses here so just trying to take a look even though dresses aren't on my thrift wish list you just never know you just you have to look you have to look in every section we do have some velvet this is actually a really pretty velvet tone it's kind of a oh interesting it's a unitard huh fascinating it is from fashion nova with the fashion nova tag still attached very very interesting oh i think this is kind of possibly vintage it's from honors really pretty floral dress not really what i'm going for but i feel like someone else is gonna absolutely love this okay this is not in my size but it's absolutely gorgeous if you are in an extra large please come and buy this i don't know where or why you you would wear this but come on i'm hoping on camera maybe i'll bump up the exposure because it is a maxi velvet burgundy dress with a puff sleeve. It's from the Pyramid Collection, so I don't know brand wise, but it is absolutely gorgeous. I wish it was my size. Oh my goodness. They have it in green, the exact same one in green. Stop it. This would be definitely perfect for the holidays with tags attached. Veal to New York so pretty i had taken a little detour into the jewelry section i tried on a silver wash and then also glasses neither of them worked unfortunately but now i'm back into the clothes and i'm not looking for a, tur a black turtleneck it's literally just like a black long sleeve but not knit which i am in the knit long sleeves but they they put other stuff that's not knit like a sweater material if that makes sense in this section as well oh this is so pretty it's a hundred percent cashmere oh it's absolutely gorgeous 
This button up is so fun. Not my size, but I love the collar is a corduroy and then the kind of embroidery on there is so pretty. This top is a little long, but it's originally Karen Scott and it has a boat neck. I wonder, could I cut it? This actually would be a top I maybe would cut. It's in an extra small, but it doesn't look like an extra small. I'll put it on my cart. I've been kind of getting into purple a little bit lately, but I'm like, is purple my color? What shade of purple works for me? So I feel like this top could maybe be good. It's really soft. I may try it on. Mm, actually, this may work. Long sleeve. What material is it? Oh, paper tag. Oh my gosh. 100% combed cotton. Hmm. I'll hold on to that. I didn't really find that much in the top section. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I wish this was for an adult. Oh my gosh. That's so amazing. Anyway, um, I am in the Christmas section now. I had kind of kept going past the Christmas and the jacket section when I first got here. I knew I wasn't gonna get anything, and so I wanted to go to the things that I'm actually looking for. But now that I've kind of gone through most of the sections, um, I just wanna see what they have, just for funsies. I actually don't have that many Christmas sweaters. This is very cute. It's like winter Christmassy without being like Santa right in your face. Again, if this was an adult size, I would buy this. Oh, this is such a pretty kind of holiday sweater dress. Now into the purses. I am kind of looking for a maroon purse or like a burgundy, more of like a burgundy, not a maroon. I don't know why I said maroon. Like this is a little too bright. I want something darker. I do need a new wallet. It's kind of a fun one. It's actually a really good size. to the home decor and there really wasn't anything especially the wall art section nothing in, that was like grabbing my attention although shout out to the kindest viewer that just said hi to me truly absolutely made my day if you're watching hello but it is now time to go through my cart i i don't know i really don't know what i'm going to buy a lot of sweaters my hair is probably gonna get messed up putting all of that on but Let's take a look and, and, and see. This is really cute. Just, I don't really, I don't even really know why I put it in my cart. I think it was like, oh, it's really well made and it's really nice, but I don't think something that is fully true to myself. So I'm going to leave it, but again, made super well. I think I'll have to take this over to the mirror. I mean, I was really just looking for a black long sleeve and this is a black long sleeve. It is really nice. Like it's the sleeves are long enough. The material is really soft. So I think I am gonna get it. I'm really looking at these long sleeves as layering. So they're pretty boring, but it's how you style them that makes a difference. And this one's just okay. I don't think I love it that much. Even though the black one is super plain and not too much going on as well, there's something about it that I like more. So I think I'm gonna say no to this. Opposite to the last one, this one's also pretty plain, but I love the neckline. It's just this that I think I would want to cut off. This cardigan is all right. I think I just want one that's more just chunkier. I don't know. I like the color though, but I think I am going to leave it. This cardigan kind of looks like animal print and yeah, not, not really what I'm searching for. So I'm going to leave it. I actually think this poncho looks really good, potentially with the outfit I'm wearing right now. This is the thing I don't love about ponchos is then I just look like this and whereas it looks better if my hands are just stay down. I just really don't like the hood and I would wish it was in a little bit of a darker red, but I 
actually really cute. I am very excited for whoever ends up thrifting this. This is actually quite a nice chunky sweater and it's not itchy either. I'm gonna take it over to the mirror to properly be able to see it, but I am pretty tempted. I did get a chunky kind of cream sweater at a clothing swap a couple like month ago um, that I'm gonna include in like a future collective thrift haul and they aren't exactly the same but they are kind of similar and so I'm trying to decide like are they different enough or is it just the same thing um so it's a maybe sorry for the abrupt end of the going through my cart portion but all of a sudden just like a bunch of children came into the toy section which is where i placed my camera on to go through my cart and yeah it was a little overwhelming and then there wasn't really anywhere else that didn't have people to film like the last thing that was in my cart which was like this purple turtleneck sweater and i knew i wasn't gonna get it i just didn't love the way that it kind of hung on the hanger and I just felt like with trying it on I probably would feel the exact same way so I was kind of meh about it anyway and then I just put everything that were nose back and just checked out um and that that is where we are now I ended up not getting any of the Black Friday deals because I only got two things that ended up being like $17 so I think to get the first percentage sale of 20% off you had to spend $30 but I did have because of the point system that they had I had a 20% off coupon um so i ended up getting a discount but not the black friday discount and i'm kind of going back and forth about posting this video i don't know it just obviously i didn't like get the most insane stuff for the most insane price but the stuff i did get i actually am pretty happy about they're pretty plain but it's something that i've been looking for so i think i am going to post this video because this this is just how going to the thrift store is sometimes it's a hit and sometimes it's still a hit but just in a different way so let's just get into what i got which is the black lawn sleeve i'm actually really excited about this i can't believe how excited i am about this plain lawn sleeve but it's just really soft and i think it's going to be an amazing piece for this winter i will actually film a trial portion so you can properly see it but yeah this one was seven dollars and 99 cents but because i got the 20 percent off normal discount it ended up being six dollars and 39 cents oh and it is from the brand maiden america it does have a paper tag so i don't i don't know if it's vintage or not it says made in the u.s so i don't know but yeah it's, it's in really great condition it's great quality next i have this kind of like cranberry boat neck top originally from karen scott and it would have been eight dollars and 99 cents but with the discount i got it for seven dollars and 19 cents and i'm actually again also really excited about this one because i feel like the possibilities of styling it for this winter are gonna be endless the only thing i will do is cut or maybe i'll like cut it and then hem it or maybe i'll keep a raw hem i don't know of this like lace bottom usually i would have left it because i'd be like oh like maybe somebody that would like the bottom of it would want it but this is literally like the perfect top of what i've been looking for there's a really similar one on reformation that's like 70 dollars that i've been going back and forth about purchasing and now i have this one and it just needs a little a little small snip snip at the bottom and there were so many tops that were similar to this that are like long with kind of something at the bottom that i feel okay with giving it a little spruce up for what i have been wanting but yeah that's what i got this was actually such a positive thrift with me like i had so much fun and i went through everything but this was just what was calling to me also shout out to all the nice people that complimented my outfit like i, I mean yeah sometimes i get complimented at the thrift store but today especially i think it's because obviously who wouldn't compliment this cat christmas crew neck and then my beautiful plaid skirt so yes i would compliment me as well in this outfit but there were just such nice people today it was just actually a really great time even though i ended up not getting the 
Black Friday discount. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully you did have a fun time going through the thrift store with me. If you would like to see my face again, then make sure to subscribe right down below and hit that little bell to be notified every time I make a new video. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram, which is alexandjine83. I will see you all in my next video. Bye.